Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. Thank you guys so much for clicking on the video and joining in with me on Red Dead Redemption. I'm so, like, happy to be playing this and sharing it. Oh, what the hell? What the? You come near me, sailor, and I'll slash you up. You put that knife down or you're gonna be missing a hand. Right? What is wrong with you two? I ain't chopping vegetables for a living. Oh, I'm sorry, madam. Was there insufficient feathers in your pillow? I ain't lazy, Mr. Morgan. I'll work, but not this. Well, I ain't cooking work. <sighs> My husband and I, we shared the work. All of it. I was out in the fields. I can hunt, carry a knife, or use a gun. But I tell you, you keep me here, I'll skin this fat old coot and serve him for dinner. Watch your damn mouth, you crazy goddamn fishwife! <laughs> no, both Gosh. of you. Well, come with me then. You want to head out there, run with the man? So be it. But we do more than just hunting. We're hunted. And them things hunting us, so they got guns of their own. I ain't afraid of dying. Good. You need anything, Mr. Pearson? Maybe me and Mrs. Zad are gonna take a little ride. Yeah, sure. Here's my list, and can you post this letter for me while you're there? Sure. Come on, princess. <laughs> Look at the way he's looking at it. Are you coming with me then, woman? Damn, man, she's got a bit of bite. So I've graduated from chopping vegetables to shopping. Shut your goddamn mouth. I wonder how this is going to go down. Yeah. Um, Pearson, I thought this was... I actually thought... Hang on. Uh, where am I going? Progress. I actually thought it was Sadie Adler. That's who I thought it was. Let me just have a look. Oh no, it doesn't show up. Alright, let's just see what it's about. You cool down then yet? I guess. No, I ain't no scullion. And I sure as hell ain't taking orders from that sweat half wit. I guess we all gotta do our share, Princess. Huh. Where's that letter? Are you reading his mail now? Oh, robbing and killing's okay, but letter reading's where we draw the line. Mm. There. <clears throat> Dear Aunt Kathy, you are some else. I haven't heard from you in some time, <laughs> so I pray to the Lord above that your health has not deteriorated further. Blah blah blah. It's boring. Ooh. <laughs> Wait a sec. Listen to this. Since we last corresponded, I have traveled widely, making no small name for myself. <laughs> Before you ask, I am still yet to take a wife, but I can assure you it's not for a lack of suitors. <laughs> he ever actually even talked to a woman he ain't paid for? Oh, look. We're all hiding behind something. <laughs> now what's this? Return Oops. to Tacitus Kilgore. Oh, that. Well, that's Dutch's idea. All mail to be sent to the same alias. Whatever we set up somewhere new, Strauss, he heads into town. Tells him to start expecting mail from a Tacitus Kilgore, whatever they changed it to. <laughs> Here, give me that back. We got work to do. Okay. Here, Here we, we go. So that was actually was really funny. I shoot the shopkeeper. Well, oh, no. shit. Are you insane? Well, I thought we was outlaws. Outlaws. Not idiots. We rob fools that rob other people. These people, they're just trying to get by. So you head on in there and you buy some food to eat. And no guns. You sure? This time, there'll be time for killing soon enough. What are you doing? I'm gonna go check the mail. Nothing exciting. She seems crazy. Like crazy. 
That winch and they were reading that letter, that was quite funny. That's a nice horse. Might have to I can't even rob. Man, where is that dog? Very annoying. Okay, let's go to the post office. Ooh, stamina increase, 50%. I haven't, I haven't actually been to a uh, a post shop before, so I'm actually interested to see how it sort of all works in here. All right, here we go. How do you do, sir? Can I help you, Mister? Yes, I would like to post a letter. All right. I think that's it. Postable items done. Okay, no trouble. Thank you. Bye now. That's it. I wonder if we can do anything else. Pay bounty. Uh, so if you got a bounty on you, you I think you can pay it. That's good to know. I have a feeling something's gonna go wrong with that lady, Mrs. Pearson, Ms. Pearson. So there's a butch to my left. All right, that's it. What the hell? She got a different outfit. What the hell is that dog doing? <laughs> just randomly appeared. Alright. Oh yeah, so it is safe. safe. Wait, hang on. I'm getting so lost right now. Thanks. Here. Take that for yourself, okay? Thanks. Well, give it back then. Jesus. I didn't ask for his goddamn help. Okay, get on. I'm about done here. So wait, I thought that was Miss Pearson. Why does it... But now it says Sadie. I'm so I lost. Why don't you drive? Okay. Come on, lady, get a move on. I like Should probably close the back. Don't start. I can wear what I damn well want. Like I told you, my husband and I shared all the work. I wasn't some little wife with a flower in her hair baking cherry pies all day. Yeah, I don't doubt that. You sure look the part now. Won't be long before you're smoking cigars and playing the harmonica. I'll have you know, I used to love playing the harmonica before. Well, my house and everything I own got burned to the ground. I know. I'm real sorry about what you... Uh, you know. Maybe I'll keep my eye out for another one. I don't want no pity. Just treat me equal and no. Nobody's tip. Let's go and check out this item request. Sadie had us asked for a harmonica. Okay. Nothing for me ever again. Mm-hmm. Just don't kill the camp cook. Please. Hey there! Oh, what? Hey. What, uh, what you folks up to? Just heading home. You're in Lemoyne Raider country. Keep it cool. Steve. You need to pay a toll to pass through here. No, I don't think so. You don't think uh, so? She's got a revolver out. How about you pull over right now? Pull over? That's what I said. Hey, how's about this? No. Oh, sh go, shit. Go. Shit. Let's get the hell out of Oh, what? Go. Alright, it's on. What the hell was that? They was gonna rob us. Ooh, shot. Oh what, there's another one. Guy up in front. Oh shit, she just ran him over. Oh man, we're like proper surrounded. There he is. I don't remember I need to get behind cover. There we go. I might shoot this guy first. Ooh, on the top of the head. I think we're good here, Arthur. 
I'm gonna get out of here before the cops come. No, pass those reins here. Why? Because you've caused enough trouble already. I'm fine. Yep. We show those bastards, huh? No, I might even actually just. I'm being a bit greedy here, but I need the money. <laughs> oh man, there's nothing there. I'm just gonna check this guy if it doesn't. Ooh, they look like they're sort of uh, getting it on. <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna check like one or two of them. If they don't really give me much money, I'm not gonna sort of bother with them. Um, so they're giving me. Giving me a little bit. Mostly, um, something I'm noticing with loot, they usually just give you more uh, ammo. Uh, it's not really something I'm after. I'm more after sort of someone with a large stack of cash. Sort of expect a little bit more from these guys. I was hoping that um, because they rob others that they might have a little bit more. Alright, so this is going to be the last one. Alright, I'm done. I'm not really trying to go through and robbing every single person just because I feel like... I don't know... Careful! So who do they say they want? Lemoyne Raiders? Yeah... I've run into them before. Some local gang. They don't seem to have grown out of playing soldiers. Anyway... Why don't you go upset and piss about that letter? How dare you! I want to bring you... Oh shit! Making no small name for myself. I won't be giving you no mail to post anytime soon, that's for sure. <laughs> I just want to peek in that journal of yours. The mind of Baldus. Not a chance. Man, this this lady, Sadie, she's crazy. Like actually crazy. I feel like this time going to be some sort of story plot with her, otherwise they wouldn't exactly show her. Alright. Here we go. You didn't get yourself killed then, Miss Adler. Not quite. <laughs> well, I'd like to say I missed your refined conversations, but I'd be lying. Ah. Uh I enjoyed myself out there. Yes, we, uh, Mrs. Adler did okay. At shopping? Yes, at shopping. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Don't mention it. I would ride with you again, Mrs. Adler, if you will ride with me. Maybe. <laughs> if you prove you can handle yourself. Well, they say I lack finesse, but I ain't afraid of gun smoke. <laughs> we got this, Arthur. You've already done me a big favor today. Okay, Miss High and Mighty. And nice pants, by the way. Oh, shut up. Why are you always under my feet, Williamson? You busy, Arthur? Alright, so let's check out this mission. Hey, Arthur. C can I have a quick word? We're right close to it. Who is that? Molly. I've never done a Molly mission before. Let's just see what she's got to say. Yes, Miss O'Shea. Ah, call me Molly, would you? Oh. Arthur, how is Dutch? I mean, how does he seem to you? I'm about the same as usual, I guess. I... I really love him, you know. But if he... Like he always says, loyalty is everything, so... Arthur! Excuse me, Miss O'Shea. What you want? I bring a gift. The great gift of information. So you got some tip off, so now I can yeah. risk my neck and make you some money while you lounge around. You know, Arthur, bitterness, it, it works on the inside as well as on your sour face. If you say so, but you could go find some other fool to run your errands. Bill, come on over here. Will you be my other fool? You too, Charles. What are you? Talking about. Arthur's above a little stick up I heard about. No, I'm not. You just said. Hey, I'll do it. As long as you ride with us. <laughs> I got a serious medical condition. <laughs> yes, you are a compulsive liar. Uh, no need to be like that. Charles, have I ever lied to you? 
I hardly know you. Exactly. Now, you boys should do this. It, it's easy, and I'll only take a small commission for my information. But it's now or never. Then it's never. Oh, God help me. Fine. I'll do it. <laughs> well, what is it? It's a supply wagon carrying payroll, but very briefly unguarded, apparently. As it passes through a crossroads near here where there's an old ruined church before it connects with the rest of the wagon train. Very easy picking. As long as we get paid or you get shot, I'm happy. You are a sick man, Arthur Morgan. A very sick man indeed. A sick man. <laughs> You miserable bastards. Okay, okay, we're coming. How you get wind of this old man? We only been down here all in five minutes. Well, wow, you boys been off fishing or playing lawman or whatever the hell you've been doing. I've been getting down to business. <laughs> Finding the nearest grog house. Hey, you don't want in on this, Williamson. That's fine by me. Do us all a favor. Head home. Just give it a rest, you two. Just have a little faith for once, will you? I've been scoping jobs like this since you fellers were knee-high to a grasshopper. Once a decade, maybe. So what is it you scoped here exactly? Well, I told you. There's a wagon with a lockbox passes through every week. They switch outriders just north of here, but the front wagon's by itself for a stretch before the last run down in the roads. <laughs> okay, hold up here. We should cover our faces. Oh, they'll be pet. Gotta put my bandana on. Where is it? There we go. Look through the crossroad. What's up ahead? Wind. Soon, Williamson. Christ's sakes. I should be due any time now. Let's keep this quiet and clean. Nobody needs to die here. There. You see, gentlemen? <laughs> Just like clockwork. <laughs> All right, here we go. That was actually really close to our camp. Uh, I might just switch this out. Um, don't want that one. Where's the one that we got? I think that was it. Stop the wagon! I said, stop the damn wagon! Whoa! Now, don't try anything stupid. Do anything good. You know, boys, I, I don't, I don't want to get shot, but this is a mistake. I work for Cornwall Kerosene and Tar, Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Oh, great. So, you know, <laughs> who doesn't? I hear he's rich enough to share the wealth around and not miss it too much. Oh, he'll miss it. Okay, why don't you check out around the back? All right, that's me. Are you going to give me a hand here? Let's see what's inside. It's funny how we've, uh... Um... Okay, we're looking good. Must be nearly Ooh. done. Something. Oh, great. Let's go, Arthur. Let's go. Yeah. I think they're the cops. Oh shit. Oh, we can look behind. We can look behind this. Escape the pursuers with There's the gang. Oh my horse, my horse. Oh no. Uh oh. Oof. That was so bad. Oh my god. Where? <laughs> I tried to do a sharp right turn, but I um, yeah, I'm not knowing any Lamborghini. <laughs> the horse do need a little bit of headspace there. All right. 
I'm not gonna do that mistake again. Let's go, let's go. Oh, there's a guy to my left on the map. Oh, he's on the horse as well. Alright, so it looks like... Ooh, got him. <laughs> they sound like they're in uh, law enforcement. Okay, I think we actually got away. My horse's stamina, I'm sort of keeping one eye on my horse's stamina there. Oh, it looks like we might stay here. Let, let, let's hide in here. Quick! Whoa, damn it! Get out of here. Get out of here, go on. Ooh. See you later. Shit. Alright. Let's get out of sight. Stay until dark. And then we'll sneak out of here. Charles, you keep watch for now. Sure. Well, we uh get some rest. Ugh. That was a crazy pursuit. All right. <clears throat> Let's try and get out of here. Hey, shit. Absolutely. Oh, shut up, old man. Look, I was just trying to... Shut up. There's a light over by the house. Damn. Hey, now let's just keep this calm. See what happens. So that was actually Cornwalls, man. Is this your place? Kinda. Uh, and you didn't hear nothing? Uh, uh, I... Why don't you just tell me, partner, what you heard? Go ahead. Go ahead. Tell me what you heard. I don't... Uh, maybe I, I heard some noises out by the barn a while ago. It ain't me. Ah, oh, shit. Go check out the, the barn. Sir. Oh man, this isn't gonna go down well. Here they come. Oh no. Shit. Can't even go anywhere. It's just sort of locked onto this. Maybe we gotta um, take one down, someone else will take the other down. Place looks deserted enough. Sure. You head inside. I'll go round the back. Oh man. All right. So I might just try and knife him. Oh shit! He's gonna see me. Do I have my throwing knives? I remember I had my throwing knives at one point. To me. The old guy up there is full. Who oh, got him? Oh, ah, shit. Uh, God damn it, Arthur. What was that? Let's fly at them, boys. Oh, gosh. I actually, I think I was supposed to, um, hold back. We got more of them bastards on this. Where are they all coming? Crap. Uh, which one was my. All right, I'll use this. Looks like Mr. Cornwall's gone up to security. Ooh, good shot. This fella really don't like getting raw. Let's just hope we don't run out of bullets. Ooh, headshot. There's a goddamn horde of them on the left here. Put a bullet out of damage. They're coming in this way now. I'm gonna take this guy out. Ooh, good shot. They're coming in from the front. Shit, fire! Behind you, Charles. We got more on this side. Oh man, it is. Place is on fire, shit. Alright. Oh, 
seconds from finding us anyway. If we don't get out of here soon, we're charcoal. Shit. I think I've got to put him down. Uh oh. Alright, where is it? There he is. He's not taking a shot for some reason. Alright, there we go. That was so close, I thought I was gonna die there. I really wish I didn't um, throw my knife at that guy. That was such a bad. Where are we going, Bill? We'll try to lose him in the woods. Bit impulsive there. I thought that's what I had to do because he was just sort of standing there. But oh well. Split up a bit. Try to confuse him. Arthur, with me. All right, this way. I was wondering who that was with the bald head. I'd never seen him before with the um here they come. You see anything? Not yet. Alright, I'll take this guy down. Got him. Bastard! Get the hell off me! Actually, <laughs> you made a meal out of that, didn't you? This is a young man's game. <laughs> uh oh, clearly those boys ain't as quiet as us. Oh man. We should go give him a hand. Oh, full stimulant. All right. I can't even see him. Alright, there we go. Just sort of using the auto assist here. I need to move up. There he is. Actually, I think that's a friendly. Now we got coal on our backs. It was an honest mistake. I had to leave it. Go on, get out of here. Every man split up. Go on, run quick. Good luck, Jens. Stay quiet.